And yet Biden remains silent in his basement in the face of this brutal assault on our nation and the values of our nation. Joe Biden has surrendered to his party and to the left-wing mob. He has no control. Does anybody honestly think he controls these radical maniacs? You know what he says to his wife when he's not confusing her with his sister? Get me the hell out of here. These people are crazy. That's what he says. He has absolutely no control. You know, a lot of times I'll make like a speech and I'll have this beautiful paragraph come out criticizing every little aspect of the speech. Beautiful, brilliant. But Joe didn't. And it'll say a comment from Joe Biden. But he didn't say it. Professional people, great students in English lit. People that are very smart say it. Joe Biden said, and they're going through this highly complex paragraph, beautifully worded, and I say, Joe didn't say that. Joe doesn't even understand it. And if Biden is elected, he will surrender your country to these mobsters, 100%. Your 401ks, by the way, look at how we're doing in the stock market. Just set another record with NASDAQ. NASDAQ. Your 401ks and money itself will be worthless. Your 401ks are doing very well, unless, I don't want to say, if you were stupid, I said, don't sell, don't sell. It went down, but we got it back up. And now NASDAQ, think of it, NASDAQ just set a record. And I think you're going to see a lot of records. And next year, if we don't do anything stupid on November 3rd, you are going to have the greatest economic year we've ever had. That'll be next year. If the Democrats gain power, then the rioters will be in charge and no one will be safe and no one will have control. Joe Biden is not the leader of his party. Joe Biden is a helpless puppet of the radical left. And he's not radical left. I don't think he knows what he is anymore. But he was never radical left. But he's controlled by the radical left. And now he's really controlled. His campaign staff even donated a lot of money to bail out rioters, looters, and arsonists who ravaged Minneapolis. They bailed them out. They put up a lot of money to bail them out, the rioters, the looters. And they were. They were the arsonists. So they'll say, oh, it's terrible what he says about the people of our nation. Maybe some of them aren't even from our nation. The left is trying to do everything they can to stop us. Every hour of every day, including even violence and mayhem, they'll do anything they can to stop us. Look what happened tonight. Look at what happened tonight. Law enforcement said, sir, they can't have, they can't be outside, it's too dangerous. We had a bunch of maniacs come and sort of attack our city. The mayor and the governor did a great job, but they were very violent people. And our people are not nearly as violent, but if they ever were, it would be a terrible, terrible day for the other side, because I know our people. I know our people. But we will never submit to their threats and we will never let them destroy our nation. What they did tonight, I saw.